kind of hit the ground running because we've been working so hard all summer, and it's just really good to get back in the gym and kind of focus on, on the whole team as a whole. Senior season for you, hard to believe that's uh, already here. And uh, this, what's it like for you trying to take a little more of a leadership role this season? Yeah, it's definitely something I worked on all through the spring as well. And, um, you know, it's just time. I have, I have to lead. It's, you know, part of the role. And I'm really excited to embrace that. And I've been really working hard on that and talking to the girls, and they're helping me too. So. Talk about the spring, just what it was like having just about everybody who's going to be here this fall, having that whole group together to be able to, to work together to compete. Just talk about the spring. It was huge. I mean, we had enough that we could compete against each other, which is normally we're scrambling to put two teams together even. So that was huge. We did a lot of competing all of spring, and um, everyone got in to play every position, and that was really important. And it also helps because now we don't have to spend as much time this preseason kind of introducing the new girls to our system. We have Matty and we're working with her on that. But other than that, we've really got to hit the ground running. It's going really well. Kevin talked about having so much depth where if somebody's struggling, you, you've got someone else who can come in and, and you know that they can do the job. What's that like for you knowing that if you're having an off night, you know, maybe someone else will be uh, coming in to take your spot? Yeah, it's going to, I mean, it's going to be something we have to work on. It's a challenge for everyone, but the level of respect that this team has for each other, I think is the highest that I've ever been around in a group. So we know that like, if one girl deserves to play and you're not having, like, that's what the team needs and we know that she's just as strong. And so that's really something that's different and really beneficial. Just uh, thinking back to where things were at the end of last season to uh, where they are now, who are some players on the squad do you think that have really just taken that next step from uh, last season to the start of this year? Um, definitely the outsides, Michelle and Katie, you know, they came in as freshmen and now they kind of had a whole year of spring training, so they understand that. I mean, really, top to bottom, everyone has just taken huge jump leaps uh, as far as their talent. Allie Stark is great opposite hitter right now. She's phenomenal. And, um, you know, everyone from the start, even when Brandy came in the spring, just the, how the growth she's had and really everyone, the setter, setter's competition, like I can't, every position is just, everyone is getting better and it's really cool to see. For yourself personally, what, what, what kind of goals have you set for yourself for this year's senior season? Personally, I just want to be the best I can for the team. You know, i kind of setting aside any personal. This is, as a senior, it's time to give all I have to the team. And so all my goals are team related and I want to be the, I want, basically my goal is to be the best leader for this team. And team goals, what, you, what have you guys talked about in terms of where you want to be by the end of the season? Um, I mean, every season we're expecting a championship. So I'm going to throw that out there, and that's our goal, and we're working for that every day. It's going to be really challenging, but that's the standards we have now. And for you outside hitters, you've got really three different setters who have shown, at least in the spring, that they can step in and do the job. Yeah. Um, what's it like adjusting to, to three different people giving you the ball on the outside? Um, They've done a really good job of knowing us, and we've kind of figured out how they work. And so it's just a matter of putting a lot of time in to work on that connection. And it's gone pretty smoothly. Like, we're constantly rotating in and out. So we're used to that transition. 